Okay, this this one might be oh. good. Oh, it's okay. Good. But no, 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 that's not that one. Okay. All right. Uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna take a gamble on this because the beginning made me laugh a bit. Part one part of the beginning. <laughs> you ready? You ready, EJ? Oh boy. All right. I'm going to send you the story in Skype called. It wasn't Lavender Town. <sighs> uh, I'm sorry, there's like a giant advertisement that I can't get rid of suddenly in front of the, the story. Okay, there we are. <laughs> Advertise on creepypasta.com. <laughs> this is about to fight. Aspiring businesses, here are some scary stories to attract people to your business. <laughs> Creepypasta.wikia.com welcomes all sponsors. <clears throat> Right. You know about. If you click on any of those, no, oh, yeah, don't fine, do it. By the don't way, do it. <laughs> their CPM is terrible. It's the weirdest thing. Um, <laughs> you know about Lavender Town. Well, it starts off a little presumptuous. You know that the town's sorrowful music can tear out of the game, enter through your ears, consume your head, and leave you screaming for the end to stop the pain, stop the wailing of the death that never end. Screaming until you until you find a way to silence it. I'm going to tell you a story. If you wish to aid yourself in setting the stage, go ahead and open a new tab and bring up that music. Indulge yourself in its 8-bit horror. Just don't go away. Don't leave. Because I found the truly terrifying secrets of the ghost town. <sighs> Scary. Creepypasta. In any, oh, excuse me, any innocent Pokemon fan playing through red or blue, or if they live in Japan, green, could have <laughs> could have figured it out. But they, they didn't live to bring the haunted truth to justice. I know I might be next, but I have to do this for the good of you all, to save lives even. As I said, any innocent Pokemon fan, whether they're young or veterans, setting out on their first journey or revisiting the franchise's roots, any one of them could have done it. We'll never know if they did, though, will we? Let's begin. Ooh. Said innocent fan has just made it through the rock tunnel, their team beaten and battered, anxious to rest. They crawl to Lavender Town, and before they can shudder at the sounds that echo through the Barren Valley Town, they drag themselves to the friendly, familiar Pokémon Center. Its own cheery music offers a sanction to the sane, temporarily. Well, apparently not because of the blood. Right, blood yeah. No, he's, he's established there's nowhere is safe in life. When they inevitably mm. lead, they offer their ears and therefore lives to the spirit of Lavender. And there it stands, nestled away in plain sight. It grins, knowing that soon its hungry, growling voices will be fed. Fed by the tender souls of the pure. And its watchful eyes observe, and the starving gray faces swoop almost too close as the victim is unknowingly warned by a young child. <clears throat> That white hand on your shoulder, I'm just imagining it. But no, 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 you mustn't leave, it beckons. Just go anywhere with it. The boy, blissfully ignorant, leaves the quiet town and the anxious specters sink back into their solitude and depression. God. But you know, inevitably, irrevocably, that their prey should have shall return. I always feel like these people just bought a thesaurus that day. Yeah, they, it really comes off like that. And they smile full of malicious, sadistic hunger. As soon as they, as soon they can feel the return of the trainer's innocent presence. Yes, yes. What is this? The boy moves closer, closer, closer. Upon. Uh. Wait a sec. Oh no, what happened? I lost my what place! Happened? Oh god, Upon the mall of the secret! The, the Upon real the mall of the secret! Sorry, I went to the chat real quick and it looked like I needed to reload the page. Um. Ahem. <clears throat> The wailing chorus of the town's song rising in a crescendo as the unknown Pokemon fan steps inside. And they begin their song, shrieking like the brutal death of a banshee, a lost soul waiting for its pitiful death. It gets louder and louder and never stops its song. 
It continues until the screeching worms its way inside you and hooks painfully into your brain and begins leeching off your life. Oh wait, is this the same thing where the music just... Oh wait, here we go. Oh no. Okay, it becomes first person in a bit. I'm not... This, this narrative's really cool. Yeah, I, I don't just really... Saying. I can't follow it. I'm reading it, I can't... <laughs> the high-pitched chorus gives a wicked grin. Their prey has no escape now. Clueless child or even seasoned Pokemon fan still doesn't know. Still doesn't understand. Uh, what did they understand? Oh. I'm starting to get... I'm starting to get weak. I'm halfway through this stupid place, and for some reason I'm not getting attacked by any wild Pokemon. I swear, my character is walking progressively slower. The music's starting to get louder. It's beginning to give me a headache, but it makes me feel so twisted and vicious for some reason, and for some reason I don't mind. A huge shiver racks my spine and I shake from it. I'm starting to feel chilly. My shadow... It's getting longer. The ghosts... The ha- Wait, is this first or third person now? Alright. The ghosts, the haunted inhabitants of this horrible place, begin their drain. If they're lucky, their victim will be gone before they understand. Sometimes they do understand. Sometimes it all clicks. But they're already too far gone. And their last anguished thoughts gives the spirits a hearty meal. Never has one finally uncovered the secret before they were truly doomed. My side hurts. It's getting hard to breathe. There's like eight stories kind of mishmashed together. Something like what, that. what are you doing in the game? I'm just battling my rival and I might lose. I can't I can't get to the stream anymore. <sighs> oh, I Jesus. know. It's, it's the horror, it's just taking over your desktop and now everything. I know, is God. Um let's see. My side hurts. It's getting hard to breathe. It's like my character is moving at the normal pace again, and I'm the one that's slowed down. I feel a cold draft and shudder again. I sense a dark grin staring at me. The music keeps playing even as I battle these poor channelers. Oh, we're battling channelers? Did they say that before? Um, as you go through the tower in Lavender Town, you fight these people who are possessed oh, by ghosts, okay. I guess. It's all I can hear. By now I knew something was wrong, but I felt a nagging in my brain that told me to ignore it. Since that was the easier solution, I continued on. The ghost's wicked laughter make up the chorus. Ooh, the singing of the dying banshee, the screams, the screams of the dead Pokemon, their wrath, their vengeance, their misery poured out into one awful serenade with one message, to join them in death. I reached the final floor. Still no wild Pokemon. Oh, Thinking oh. back somehow, I'm shocked I never saw it before. Those who died, they were all in Lavender Town. They were trying to leave, trying to get out. Out of the real culprit's grasp, but they never made it. I stood on the final floor of the Pokemon Tower, alone in my room and in the dark. It's some time past midnight. My head is pulsing with pain and I'm shaking from the cold. I wanted to go take some pills for the headache, but that would le mean leaving my tiny safe sanctuary. I pulled the soft blanket closer, tighter around me, trying to get warm. Now, for those of you, by the way, who are thinking maybe this is fan fiction or something, here's the crazy part, and I'm quivering almost too bad to press the buttons on my Game Boy SP. Wait, so he's... Right? Wait, no. <laughs> I, is he in this tower? Is he in a tower playing the, his Game Boy? He's in a haunted tower that's like the one in the game, playing his Game Boy. And in the game, he's in the haunted tower. Is that what's The camera is zooming in and out of the boy playing the game into the character, into the character's <laughs> head. <laughs> Was this legitimately written by a crazy I person? It must have been. I think you have to be a little bit just to start a serious endeavor about of this nature. And I'm quivering almost too bad to press the buttons on my Game Boy SP. It's still getting louder. Not break your eardrums loud. Loud in the sense that I heard, no. I felt the music coming from everywhere. There were low, deep whispers coming from it, and I went pale in fear. I make my way through the simple maze of the floor, and before I reach the staircase, it's too much. I'm so dizzy, and I didn't notice it until now. 
I'm not just shaking from the cold, I'm shaking from the pain this place is putting me in. I'm mired in the pure depression of its song. The screaming, wailing melody, it won't stop and I don't think I'll try and make it because I'm too weak. Why? Why am I so weak? It's, I can't tell if he's playing the game or not anymore. I, yeah, it's all meshed together. You, you know those other creepypastas where the kind of, the ones you've read, where the subtext was, I don't know what's the game and what's mm -hmm. the life anymore. This, this one's quite, this one's actually making us yeah. question that. Like, what is the game and what is you? But it less what's because happened? of the horror effect and more that it's just kind of unclear, I find. We've, we've... It's just the really shitty writing. That's yeah, more comes. or less. We've just bled into his live journal. <laughs> <laughs> he's not even playing Pokemon, he's just talking about his event of walking through a tower. Why? Why am I so weak? The hungry evil spirits laugh, cackle, and crow too loud, taunting, teasing, belittling. They are the local servants of oil servants of the tower, stealing, always stripping their victims of sanity to feed their entity, the soul of the Pokemon Tower. It was the Pokemon Tower. And... And... And I and... know. My game suddenly freezes. I can't move anywhere, but the tower's music continues perfectly from everywhere around me. I curl into a ball, shaking and crying, pleading for the end, begging for the insanity to stop. The whispers grow to rumbling, and I can almost make out the words. I can't think right. Everything is getting foggy and murky, and I screw my eyes shut. And there they are. There they are. They're killing me and everything becomes cold black, the sound rising until it's the only thing I comprehend. It wasn't Lavender Town. It wasn't Lavender Town. It wasn't Lavender Town. That was, it wasn't Lavender Town. That was... That confused me. I, oh yeah, really. no, that definitely was, was not scary by any, any stretch of the imagination. Uh, that that creepy pasta needs to be studied. <laughs> it's it's le it's got layers, is the thing. You know, <laughs> it's kind of like it's, yeah. It's like a it's like one of those Taco Bell burritos where or like new offerings where it's like a bowl of of like the same ingredients and all that. And then yeah, I don't I don't I don't even know what to make of that. Honestly, that was awesome. I don't ex I didn't expect these to get like. I expect. I always expect the same thing. Like, oh, the game came to life, blood, yeah, uh, realistic ice level. But I didn't expect something that was that just incomprehensible. <laughs> let's 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 continue further down the rabbit hole after I quickly remind people this is a this is a donation stream for my mate's theatre company. If you could just chip in a couple of quid, a couple of dollars, a couple of whatever. That would be great because she's working really hard Absolutely. to make this educational fit project work. So, yeah. Absolutely. I just linked it again for everyone in the chat. Oh, great, thanks. What's wrong with my Shockwave Flash? It just keeps crashing on me. And that's because people aren't donating. That's why Google Chrome is failing me. 